Hi there, this is Timothy Dolan uh, with my occasional blog here from uh, Kurdistan, northern Iraq, and uh, continuing my duties as a uh, member of faculty at the American University in Kurdistan. Um, basically commenting on uh, life as I know it here, uh, which may or may not be too very representative of life in general. But I must say that uh, thus far I've had uh, very positive experiences. Uh, my place is still a dump, but it's a habitable dump. And uh, the management here, uh, the gentleman who runs the place, apparently is the owner, um, has been basically gifting things to me uh, without my beckoning and uh, often uh, simply placing things in my room, which is a little disconcerting that uh, they're opening up the place and dropping off things like a, uh, you know, a clothes dryer <coughs> hanger array. That's nice. Uh, they brought in a little cabinet for my kitchen, which was also nice. I now have some place to put my electric oven without having to shift it around too very much. The kitchen is still atrociously small. I simply have no cutting surface especially since I've received the latest gift of a dish drainer, uh, again, from the management. So it's, uh, you know, it's a mixed bag. These are very, very nice gestures. It doesn't change the structure of the place, but uh, they attend to things, and uh, I'm staying reasonably comfortable. Uh, the heating uh, is nominal, uh, barely keeps up with the temperatures, but uh, it's keeping up enough, and so uh, you know, thank goodness for small blessings. Uh, the electricity continues to kind of go off and on. They have backup generators, so you're rarely without electricity for more than really 30 seconds or so. Um, <clears throat> so there's that, but mostly I think it's uh, again from my experience, which is really more along the lines of some occasionally shop, occasionally shopping at the mall and uh, the taxi rides to and from work. Uh, the American University in Kurdistan, um, I think, is probably not too very representative of the uh, cross-section of people who live here. Uh, we do have, I think, a uh, over-representation of people who have both been abroad before and or have family uh, who are abroad and hence they have that affinity for an American style education. Um, and I am starting to learn again uh, through the kindness of the students. There have been occasions when I've walked down the road along the highway uh, going to the mall which is about a mile or so from the campus. Uh, rather than taking a taxi, sometimes there are taxi avail are available, but sometimes they're not. So I'll walk along the road. Um, a few days ago, a group of students uh, stopped and picked me up and took me back uh, to the motel. It's about a 17 kilometer trip, or about 10 miles or so. So uh, very nice of them. We've had you know some good conversations in the car. This has actually happened twice now. And uh, so it's a good, good kind of offbeat way of getting to know the students. Um, <clears throat> now with the taxi drivers, again, very nice, consistently good. Um, they drive crazy, but that's the way it is everywhere and particularly here, I think. But uh, they get me here, I haven't had an accident yet. Uh, and the music they play is actually pretty interesting. There's a fairly broad range. Uh, that runs between sort of a um, Arabic dan dance pop to a uh, more kind of soulful <coughs> recital of uh, Quranic verses, which are actually quite beautiful uh, when they're when they're sung. Um, but I'd say 50% plus of the music tends to be very kind of localized uh, with local instruments fairly upbeat songs such as you might hear at a wedding or something and occasionally kind of whiny male love songs uh, and uh, by and large it's actually quite nice it's just uh, an interesting 
sound quality uh, that you get. And of course, pretty good variety from driver to driver. Uh, those are my kind of um, you know, entrees into the local music here. Uh, everybody plays it. And pretty much everybody's listening to music. Um, so there's that. Uh, I don't have too much to add at this point. I kind of wanted to keep this pretty short and sweet so that people don't get too very bored. Um, please stay tuned. I'm going to continue my narrative and uh, continue to um, you know, bring in my observations and uh, events and episodes as they pass my way. So with that, uh, best wishes and alohas.